Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Would the tax on unrealized gains apply to real estate? Unrealized capital gains refer to the increase in value of assets that have not yet been sold. This concept applies to various types of assets, including financial securities and real estate. Under current tax law, unrealized gains are not taxed until the asset is sold. However, proposals by Kamala Harris and the Biden administration aim to change this by introducing a tax on unrealized capital gains for certain wealthy individuals. The proposed tax would target individuals with a net worth of at least $100 million, requiring them to pay a minimum tax rate of 25% on the sum of their income and unrealized capital gains. Real estate, being a type of capital asset, would indeed be subject to this proposed tax. For example, if the value of a piece of real estate increases while it is still owned, the owner would be required to pay taxes on that unrealized gain annually, even if the property has not been sold. To clarify, the tax would apply to the annual increase in value of the real estate, not just when the property is sold. This means that wealthy individuals holding appreciating real estate would need to calculate and report these gains annually and pay the corresponding taxes. The practical challenges of valuing real estate accurately, especially for less liquid or unique properties, are significant. This could lead to complexities in assessing the tax liability and potential disputes over the valuation method used. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.